Hi, I'm Brenton Blanchard. I'm here in beautiful South Boston, and today I'll be making grilled tilapia with fruit salsa. We're going to start off making the salsa. Here I've diced some pineapple, mango, and green Granny Smith apple. Just going to put it all in a bowl. Just get it all in there. Next, I'm going to add uh, jalapeno, lemon zest, some minced ginger root, and also some fresh cilantro. Just want to put that all in there. We want to add a little bit of salt and pepper. I have a salt and pepper mix here. Just a couple pinches, taking a spoon. Just want to toss this together. Very simple. It's nice, light, and refreshing, comparable to a you know creamy, thick sauce. Perfect for grilling outside summertime. Here we have our tilapia. I'm going to go ahead. I've cut a couple uh, fresh lemons. Um, see, I've used the lemon zest from the lemon. So perfect that we use for the salsa. And now we just want to go ahead and squeeze this over the tilapia. Put a little bit of salt and pepper. Just go ahead and coat it again with a couple pinches. And here I have a little bit of oil. This will be good just to kind of help it so the fish doesn't stick to the grill. Just going to drizzle that on there. If you have a brush, brush works just as well. Just going ahead and drizzling it. I've already preheated the grill. It's at um, about a medium low heat, low to medium heat. Um, here I'm using a gas grill. Again, if you're using a charcoal grill, you just want um, to go ahead and make sure it's heated. You can put your hands over it. It might start to smoke. Um, but it's important to make sure the, the grill is clean. You can go ahead and, and oil it to season it as well ahead of time. So now we're ready to go. Have our tilapia. Find the area of the grill. You don't want it, when you're cooking fish, you don't want to put it on an area of the grill where it's too high of heat. Um, fish doesn't take too long to cook or to grill and you don't want to burn it. So here I found an area where it's about medium to low heat. Careful because the oil will tend to cause the flame to come up on you. Just set it on. Now you want to you want to go ahead and season the other side of the fish as well while you put it down. So I'm just going to sprinkle some more salt and pepper. Again, a little bit of oil. Now you want to be careful because you're going to be pouring this over the flame. So this is where a brush would come in handy or just lightly putting it a little spoon here. Now I'm just going to cover the grill. I'm not going to go too far because you don't want to forget about it because it can burn quickly. I'm going to let it sit for about a minute and a half. I'm going to turn the fish to let it cook evenly for about another minute and a half and then I'm going to flip it over on the other side. So I flipped our tilapia. Um, now I'm going to go ahead and check it. I've covered the grill just to let it uh, the heat stay within the grill. Again, I haven't gone very far. I've only let it uh, cook about three minutes on each side. Also, will you notice a tip for when you are cooking fish? Here, tilapia is a very thin fish, and the more that, that it cooks, uh, the flakier it gets, and it can tend to dry out. So that's why you want to keep an eye on it. You don't want to go very far. Um, and also, another tip is keep it close to an area where it's accessible for you to, to flip. Also, using a fish spatula. Um, it's light, it, it's, it's thin, so it helps to get under the fish. And what you want to do is keeping it close, it helps you to be able to reach to get to it. Here I'm just gently removing the fish from the grill. Fish is cooked through. You see we have light grill marks, just keeping a careful eye on it. You know, as beautiful as grill marks can be when it comes to fish, especially tilapia, because it's so thin, you just want to make sure that it, it just absorbs that grill flavor and it cooks through. Here I'm just going to take the salsa that we made earlier, I'm just going to put it right on. Salsa also acts as a light alternative in terms of a side dish instead of using a potato. Here it's just you know, tons of flavors that go along with the tilapia using the salsa. And there we are, grilled tilapia with fresh fruit salsa.